we have calculated the six trig ratios and we can use some of them to check and make sure that our calculations were right. Remember, how we're going to check here is the following thing. The sine function is the chopping function in the y direction. It takes the hypotenuse that you have and it chops it so that it, I, I don't have 10 anymore, it chops it down and it should give me six in this direction. If I take the hypotenuse and I multiply by the sine of the angle, it means I'm multiplying by the chopping factor in the y direction. The hypotenuse never changed, it's still 10, but the sine is the chopping factor in the y direction, it was 3 fifths. So multiply by 3 fifths on the top 30, and on the bottom 5, and I divide those and I get 6. So when I take the hypotenuse and I'm multiplying by the chopping factor in the y direction, I get an answer of 6, which is the side of the triangle here. So when you take any hypotenuse and multiply by the sine of the angle, it takes the hypotenuse and it chops it and gives you this side of the triangle. Learn anything at mathandscience.com.